Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Simple Colors Opalescent Water Marble. I've got a regular cup of water and these opalescent polishes from Simple Colors. This purple one is Flight to Sea. And the blue one is Prized Plume. And then the green one is sheer flight. I'm just gonna just do a water marble with these today. They're really hard to see on film but you know hopefully it, it'll be good enough that you, you can kind of see them. <laughs> um, I have done this same type of water marble with these polishes before. I knew that they water marbled really nice. Um, I've done them over a black base. I've done them over a white base. And today we're revisiting the black base again over that black gel polish that I've been wearing and recycling. <laughs> it doesn't show up really great on camera, but the effect in real life is just show stopping. It is beautiful. Um, hopefully, my swatch photo will show you what I'm talking about. <laughs> we will see. It's one of my favorite looks. Um, that's why we're redoing it. Uh, just fun, fun stuff. I've already got my latex on and everything, so I'm ready to go. So I've got to get this stuff to working right. I need my toothpick to clean up that excess on the surface. Got a bubble. I can see it. Oh, it loosened itself up and jumped off. So there we go. You can kind of see it. Not really fantastic. I'm going to run my little tool around to break the seal. Um, so that I don't pull up any of that water marble design off of my nail. Fighting with this latex again. You guys know I fight with it. So there we go. I've got a couple of them done. I'm going to do another round. Yay! You guys know water marbling is my favorite. I've been trying to get more of them in here lately. I'm going to run that toothpick around the cup to make that spread all the way to the edge. And keep on rocking, making that bullseye. I did speed this up. I've explained to you peoples before that I am not this fast. <laughs> I got an extra little blob on the side. I got a little sloppy, but it's okay. I do turn that cup occasionally to make them spread a little better so that I can get all the drops in that I want. And there we go. We're going to do this design again. And this is that little zigzag design that I like to do so well. I don't know why it's my favorite. I don't know. It just is. I love it. So, I don't want to turn into a one-trick pony, though. So, I promise on the next real water marble, Manny, I will try to step out of my comfort zone. <laughs> there we go. Cleaning up the top of that. Getting all that excess up. La da 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 da. Let's get her done. So, and these are kind of hard to see in the water, so I do make several extra passes. There we go. Just like before, we're going to get that seal broken. Break the seal. Break the seal. And pull this latex off. Come on, snap so I can pull you off. There we go. So, there you have it. I'm cleaning off that tool. Somebody had asked me before how I clean that tool. I just take my little, you see, I take my little cotton ball and just kind of wipe it clean so it'll be ready for next time. And since I got that cotton ball out, I'm going to get some of this big stuff off that's, you know, went past my little barrier because I am a messy, messy polish player. There we go. I'm going to go in and do a little bit of tidying up with my cleanup brush and my acetone. And you can see it over on that pinky how it's picking up that light. It's just really fun. This one's really fun out in the sunshine. I'm going to top it with some Sush Vite today. I know y'all think I've lost my mind not using my posh, but you know, we've got it. Let's use it. Good to use this stuff up, not let it sit around. Nice big glossy top coat over the top of this one. And we will, you know, 
we'll finish this one up. Being sure to cap that free edge. Got to break Woody out. So hopefully you can see that. Uh, you know, I apologize that it's not, you know, better and easier to see. I do have a swatch photo. Hopefully it'll be a little better. Not so much, but anyway. So I want to thank you for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.